Hola a todos, bienvenidos a un nuevo vídeo Y bienvenidos chicos a un nuevo vídeo de Five Nights at Freddy's Y bienvenidos chicos a una nueva reacción de FNAF Bienvenidos a un nuevo vídeo donde vamos a reaccionar a otra cinta VHS terrorífica de Five Nights at Freddy's Vamos a reaccionar chicos a la cinta, a la, a la, a la cinta, a la cinta Paranormal Investigation de Spectre Que bueno, ya sabéis que hemos reaccionado a la cinta de Withered Bunny Withered chica Y ahora nos queda esta que en la miniatura está ya Lo que parecía ser Withered Freddy Así que reaccionaremos a este A esta cinta VHS Perturbadora de terror de Five Nights at Freddy's Está como siempre el vídeo en la descripción Para que le deis un buen caso al vídeo original Ya tengo miedo porque esto Lo estaréis viendo unos días más tarde pero justo acabo de grabar El de chica Y, y además se ha apagado la luz, el foco Así que se me verá un poco más oscuro Así que chicos vamos a darle caña El vídeo está en la descripción por si lo queréis, le queréis dar apoyo eh, Estoy nervioso, vídeo está originalmente en inglés Traducción automática en español eh, No me voy a leer mucho Y vamos a darle caña a la reacción, gente Vamos allá O sea, no, no me voy a leer mucho eh, Da el tirón Indoloro Play, 100 HS Alright Got a bit of an unusual call today But a job is still a job, I guess I got a call from a kids restaurant manager saying that they've been experiencing some weird paranormal activity. Vale. Alguien ha contactado a este tipo, creo que fue durante el streaming porque eh, experiencias paranormales en el local o algo así. Let's see. The place is called Ready Fazbear's Pizza. Uh, normally I get called in the places that are abandoned or Un caza fantasmas, esto tiene buena pinta. Una investigación paranormal. Me gusta. But uh The strip mall itself looks pretty new, and the manager told Ah, está en un centro comercial, qué guapo. Plan Told me that this particular location was opened roughly five years ago. He mentioned that these activities are interrupting businesses, and that they might have to close this location and reopen it elsewhere if I can't figure out what's going on. So let me go ahead and read off a few things they told me. So let's see here. Esto es lo que Fadwan Entertainment le ha dicho que ocurre al cazafantasmas. All right. Uh, they've reported that mysterious and disembodied voices can be heard all throughout the Both restaurant. Voices. property, particularly the animatronics themselves, will often move around the restaurant. Animatronic moviéndose. Mm, más hardcore eso ya, eh. Night, even when the power to the building is shut off completely. Sometimes said property will mysteriously disappear and then reappear a day or so later. And then this is one of the incidents they were telling me about where basically a bunch of kids came running out of the bathroom crying because they saw, quote, someone else staring at them in the mirror and that they were speaking in a language they didn't understand. A few employees will often feel a tense presence when working on or next to the animatronics, particularly at night. Night shift workers have reported seeing children, usually one at a time, walk around the restaurant after hours when the doors are locked. When they go to assess the situation and figure out how the child accidentally got locked in, they are nowhere to be found. And some have even disappeared in full view of a few employees. When checking the security camera footage, each in age and sex, but will consistently look between the ages of 6 and 11. Eh... Me muerdo los labios porque estoy nervioso, eh. So, Pone muy tenso esta cosa, tío. Vale, bien, bien, Poltergeist. Hay que llevar a este dolor. Y supuestamente no sé eso por seguro hasta que pueda hacer un contacto con uno de ellos. La cosa es que si no ha sido poseído o ha muerto, parece que estas entidades no pueden ser violentas, o demonios, o algo así. Estos muy bien pueden ser los espíritus de los espíritus de los niños. ¡Famofobia, gente! ¡Famofobia! Vamos a por él. Vamos a buscar el fantasma. Vale. Vale, creo que eso es todo lo que necesito. Sí, eso es todo. Vale. Vamos. Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Si hubiera salido hace poco, estaría el letrero de la peli. Okay, Un centro comercial aire libre o algo así, ¿no? O sea, cosas americanas, yo no comprendo eso. Cosas de Estados Unidos, supongo. Vamos. Vamos adentro, gente. Oh. 
Vale, gente, está entrando, está entrando, está dentro No sé qué es eso de contexto <risa> Vale, no hay luz, no hay luz Va a prender las luces, supongo Ah, vale, que lo han apagado a posta Para la asistencia de una luz Que sea el, el portal, el, 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 el Poltergeist. 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 Como los objetos, ¿no? Y tal. No sé mucho fantasmas. Ya, linterna. Ok. Oye, pues se ve chido, ¿eh? Está muy currado. Parece real. De hecho, parece real. Los animatrónicos son los sandwiches. ¡Ey, Freddy! On stage and shut down. <risa> FNAF, dos puntos. Eh, y Freddy. And, um, there <risa> Literal, eh, FNAF. I was told there's a bear, a bunny, a chicken, and a fox. Ya, pues buena and, suerte con el oso. It doesn't seem like the bear was on stage. stage. Oye, muy chulo los, las lentejuelas que brillan. Está muy chulo. Las lentejas. Las lentejuelas. Las lentejuelas. Oh, my God. But, uh, no sé si es que tiene los ojos cerrados o son sus ojos, tío. Tío, ¿son esos los ojos de chicos tan cerrados? Dios, qué miedo, tú. No gusta nada esto. Tú, busca a Freddy, crack. Antes de nada, busca a Freddy. Nada, da igual. ¡Ey! El, el, el MF, tío, del Fasmo. <risas> ¡Qué chulo! Bueno, que no es del Fasmo, ¿no? Pero que está en el Fasmo. El detector MF. Tío, si tengo miedo, me enciendo el foco, ¿eh? Si me entra el miedo, me enciendo el foco, tío. <ríe> tengo que un interruptor. Dios. Ya estoy tenso. ¡Wow! Se encendió al nivel 3. Right now, so eh, puede que haya algo cerca. Literalmente todo oscuro podría estar Freddy a su lado, ¿sabes? Está en una joda FNAF. Ahora se pone a nivel 5 a pitar. Getting a few blips here and there, but nothing pretty oh, substantial yet. ¡Wee! Eh, 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 nivel 5, oh, nivel 5! Está aquí el fantasma. Está ahí el fantasma. Está ahí el fantasma. Bro, gente, date la vuelta, ilumina, no veo nada. No, el spirit box se puede comunicar. Tú, esto se inspira en Fasmo, sí o sí, eh. Esto se inspira en el Fasmo, sí o sí. Es literalmente como en el Fasmo, tío. Qué chulo, eh, qué chulo. ¿Qué es eso que brilla? La music box está la spirit box. A ver si estoy en voces. All right, if there's anyone in the room with me right now, please make your presence known. I need you no harm. I just need to know if anyone can hear me right now. You can either manipulate something in this room or attempt to speak to this device that I've set up for you. My name is Sean. Can you say my name back to me? Sean. Whoa, shit. Here we go. Okay. Just so I can make sure that wasn't a coincidence, can you say my name again? Sean. All right. Thank you. Los fantasmas le hablaron. Can you tell me your name? Susi, es chica. Es alma de chica. Did I hear you say Susi? Yes. Okay, hi Susi. Is there anyone else in the room with me right now or is it just me and you? They're here. Who's they, Susie? What are their names? Gabriel, Fritz, and Jeremy. Do you know their names, Susie? All right. Well, if you don't know, that's fine. Just wanted to see if you did know. How old are you, Susie? Do you remember your age? Ocho. Eight. Okay. Muy head canon todo me flipa. Must be one of the children that I've heard about. All right, Susie. I guess more to the point. How did you die? William. Do you remember how you died? 
Parpel, tira Parpel. I just want to understand what happened to you and why you're here. If you're uncomfortable telling me. Murder. Who murdered you? Parpel. Tira Parpel. Spring. Bunny. Do you remember this person? ¿Qué dirá tío? Bunny. You were murdered by a bunny? No te rías, hijo de puta, vas a morir. Yes. Wait, was that a yes? Huh? All right then. Uh, how did this bunny kill you? Cuchillo. Knife. Knife. <laughs> Susie, <laughs> was this a person dressed like a bunny? Yes. Yes. Holy shit. Hold up, I have to make sure the camera got that. Okay, holy shit. So there might have been a murder or something that happened here. Restaurant owners said that they had operated here for five years straight and the paranormal activity didn't start happening until after this July. So this may have been something that happened pretty recently. But I have no idea what that actually means though. Maybe an employee decided he or she had enough, maybe some crack job snuck in here with a bunny suit on, or maybe the spirit's just lying to me. I have no idea. I'll have to show this to the restaurant owners to see if maybe they caught something like that on the security cameras. But let me just say that these responses are certainly not unusual in a place like this. Also, what's surprising to me is how direct they are. They're fairly coherent and understandable, and I'm getting them within a pretty short amount of time, which is usually a clear sign that I'm actually speaking to someone. But anyways, let's see if we can make contact again. All right, are you still there, Susie? Oh, mierda. Susie, can you still hear me? Oh, mierda. Oh, mierda, se han movido los animatrónicos. Ah, just lost. Se han enfadado. Eh, esto va mal. Sal de aquí. Sal de aquí. If there are any spirits still in the room with me, please make your presence known. Bro, sal de aquí ya. I don't know if the camera caught that, but I think I just heard a chair move. Look, right there. That's at least where the sound came from. It's right next to my flashlight too. Did someone just pull this chair out? Are you sitting down right here? Off. Do you want the flashlight off? Okay, those are brand new batteries. There's no way my flashlight just died. Le han apagado los fantasmas a luz. Yeah, look at that. Still works. Now that the flashlight's off, will you talk to me now? Yeah. Off again? What else do you want me to turn off? La radio. Noise. Noise? You want me to turn the spirit box off? If I turn off the noise, will you talk to me? All right, let's go ahead and turn the spirit box off for now. All right, I turned the noise off. Whoever you are, I'm not trying to hurt you. I just want to have a conversation with you. Can you tell me where you are right now? The fuck is that noise? What the fuck is that? Hello? I don't know if the camera could see that, but I for sure just saw a head stick out and move over there. There should be no one here but me. So I'm gonna have to rewatch the footage to get a better look at whatever the hell that just was. But it looked like a silhouette of a person standing next to these pinball. Una silhouette en las máquinas. No lo he visto bien. A ver. The fuck is that noise? What the fuck is that? What the fuck right now? The fuck is that noise? What the fuck is that? Es verdad, se vio por un momento algo, eh. 
managed to get a better look at whatever the hell that just was. But it looked like a shallowette of a person standing next to these pin look at whatever the hell that just was. But it looked like a shallowette of a person standing next to these pinball machines. This person definitely wasn't as tall as me, so maybe it was an apparition of one of the children the night guards keep. What the fuck? Me gusta, me gusta como le ha, le ha estado media hora hablando un fantasma Ha visto un fantasma se ha sentado delante de él Y dice, what the fuck, una puerta se abre sola, ¿sabes? Es como, Dios, debería ser lo más normal ya Después de lo que acabas de hacer No, están enfadados, tío Vete aquí ya Look at that, now it's locked Is the other one locked? Yeah, the other one's locked too Well I was gonna do some stuff in the bathroom to see if I could get the spirit the kid saw to reveal itself, but uh, it seems like the spirit isn't a fan of that. So maybe I could come back tomorrow or something and see if the owners can unlock the door again and maybe take off its hinges so there won't be a door for the spirit to lock, you know? Anyways, I seriously need to check the footage because I need to make sure the camera even got what I just saw a moment ago. All right, so it looks exactly what I saw, which was pretty much a shadow apparition of someone. It also looked like it could be a small kid, maybe which would make sense if it's one of the children that the night guards were talking about. That just leads me to believe, you know, a lot more than I did originally, that maybe more than one spirit's presiding here. The voice that kept saying, off, off, sounded completely different than the first spirit I talked to, so I don't know. Let's, uh, go ahead and turn the spirit box back on, no, see if we can get Lárgate anyone else aquí. here to talk with me, and also see if any other activity will happen tonight. If not, then I'm probably gonna call it quits for tonight. <laughs> Holy shit. Hello? That's gotta be one of the children. It's Popper. Look at that. Now she's gone. Hold up. Let me grab the case so I can see what that's about. Bro, tío, Freddy. Oh. Ahí está. Huh, well, I guess that explains where you were the entire time. I'm, uh, I'm having a bit of a hard time believing you were left like that, though. I want to at least try to do a session with one of these things, so I guess now's a better time than any to see if these spirits are in fact controlling the animatronics themselves. Going in with the big guns now. I'm gonna set up an ovulus for this session. So hopefully I can get oh, some bullets. clearly spoken words. All right. Is there anyone in the room with me right now? Obulus creo que es como en plan no sé como la, la verdad es que no, no sé qué es, pero solo ha servido raro como de de una voz robótica, a lo mejor es para que el fantasma hable más fácilmente o algo así. Eso no está en favor. Anyone who'd like to communicate with me. Oh, oh, oh. I of course mean you no harm. I just want to know if someone else is in here with me. Did uh, did someone here move the? I am. You are. Ah, vale. Si es como un aparato para que hablen directamente o algo así. Okay, good. Ostras. What's your name? Gabriel. Gabriel. Gabriel, el alma de Freddy. Gabriel. All right. Hi, Gabriel. Can you tell me roughly where you are in the room? Freddy. Bear. 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 Awesome. So you're saying you're in front of the bear? Dentro. Inside. Inside. <sighs> inside. Are you the one who moved the bear in here? Gabriel, why are you possessing the animatronics here? I'm not gonna assume you're Trapped. doing it. Trapped? You're, you're trapped inside that thing? How did you get trapped? Gabriel, I know this may be uncomfortable for you, but I can't help you unless you answer my questions. How did you get trapped in that thing? 
Okay, well, if you're still troubled by what happened to you, then I guess we can skip those questions. If it means you'll keep talking to me. Okay. Do you remember how you died, Gabriel? Do. Yeah. Murder. There it is again. Murder. That's exactly what Susie said. Do you remember who murdered you, Gabriel? Him. Him? What, what do you mean, him, Gabriel? Do you remember his name? Gabriel, whether you're trying to or not, you're causing a lot of problems for the people who own this place. Now, if you help me out... We must die, 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 die. will die. I assume you're talking about your killer. I don't know if I'm going to kill him, per se, but I'm willing to find him and make him pay for what he did to you and Susie. Now just tell me what you remember of him. Did you catch a glimpse of him, maybe? Do you remember what he looked like? What he was wearing? Purple. Purple. Okay, purple. Well, at least that's something. I was told by the restaurant owner that the employees here wear purple outfits. Did this person look like he worked here, maybe? Yes. Yes. Interesting. Did you ever see his face? Can you describe it to me? No, too dark. No, too dark. Okay, so it must have been too dark to make out the facial features, I guess. Alright, so one last thing I want to ask before I go. I was talking to another spirit here named Susie, and she mentioned something about someone in a bunny suit. Does that sound familiar to you? Gabriel, are you still there? Get out. Get out? Why? Why sal do you want me to leave, Gabriel? Get out. Get out. Bro, sal de aquí. Si te lo estoy diciendo un puto fantasma. Get out. Oh my fucking god. What the fuck? Why did this just go out? What the fuck? Whoa, 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 what the fuck? Holy shit! Wow. Okay, purple. Wow. Wow. Este vídeo ha sido muy bueno. No he visto una, un vídeo así de VHS de FNAF en muchos años, tío. ¡Qué pasada! Es como que al final William se coló en el edificio o algo así. Para atrapar al que está investigando El alma de Gabriel quiso advertirle que saliera Pero no iba a hacer caso Así que Gabriel Ha ido a asustarle a posta Para que se largara del local Pero ya era demasiado tarde Ya estaba ahí William Y al final William lo atrapó Y se llevó la cámara Oh my god, tío, qué final más bueno Oh my god Hola, muy buen vídeo, tío. Y a dar ahora mismo un buen me gusta al vídeo original que os dejaré en la descripción. ¡Qué pasada, gente! ¡Wow! Os dejo el vídeo original en la descripción para que le deis un montón de apoyo. Me he quedado flipando, gente. Ah, mira qué bueno pone. Esta cinta fue confiscada por el FBI como un caso clasificado. Ahora es lanzada al público después de 25 años. Eh, grabado el 19 de, 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 de agosto, ¿no? De agosto de, del 85 
Que bueno, como dice en el vídeo es A nada del asesinato Wow Ey, qué locura de vídeo De los mejores VHS que he visto en mi vida, tío Súper bueno, 10 de 10 En fin, chicos, no tengo nada más que decir Muchísimas gracias por haber llegado hasta el final Dale un buen me gusta y os habéis quedado igual de flipando que yo Y nos vemos en un próximo vídeo de Francha Freddy's Adiós